Good morning to you. This is Mark Suddeth, and here's what's up in the tropics for Wednesday, June the 8th, 2022 in the Atlantic Basin. Nice and quiet right now. The National Hurricane Center not expecting any areas of development over the next five days. However, the same cannot be said for the southeastern Pacific, where we have an area of medium chance for development, the area in orange there. South of the coast of Mexico, uh, a disturbance is expected to get going and eventually develop into a tropical cyclone. So we will be watching that. Other people are watching it on Twitter. This from Andy Hazelton here indicating that more development near Central America is possible by early next week. Obviously, that's on the Atlantic side, but more activity is expected in the Pacific. The GFS and its ensembles, that's what GEFS means, and the ensemble prediction system from the Euro are all showing that. So mostly in the Pacific over the next several days. Now the satellite imagery today showing some activity down there in the southeastern Pacific, generally speaking the Caribbean and most of the rest of the Atlantic Basin, nice and quiet, strong upper level winds, dry air, and other inhibiting factors, including climatology. It's just not supposed to be very busy in the month of June, and I don't see it being busy over the next five days, maybe week uh, to a week out. We'll see, though. All right, so here's the area that we will be watching for. Nothing there yet, but the vorticity will start to increase, and we will watch this area just to the south of Mexico and see what happens over the coming days. Again, the Atlantic Basin, pretty dominated by dry, mid-level air, Saharan air, dusty air. That's what all that orange and red, and even some pinks in there. In the Gulf of Mexico, that's not Saharan air necessarily. It's dry continental air coming off of Texas. I guess you could call it the Texas air layer if you want to. Uh, but yeah, there's a lot of dry air around. And again, this is typical for this time of the hurricane season. That takes a while to get mixed out. And by the time we get to August, there will be less of that. It'll retreat more to the north. And things should start to get very busy, as we would expect, at least climatologically speaking. August is when things ramp up. All right, well, that is it from me for today. No hurricane outlook and discussion today. That will resume tomorrow and uh, that'll do it i am mark Suddeth, hurricane track i appreciate you tuning in this has been what's up in the tropics i'll talk to you again tomorrow morning